Türken, schwule Juden, Digga. This is man, bro. He doesn't give a fuck. Früher habe ich immer Hitler auf die Plakate Ich hasse Ossis. Wir haben Dr. über Geldfly, wir haben auch mit Schweinefly, wir haben... Bro, he hasn't said one politically correct thing since this video started. He opened up the video on Demon Time. Wie bringt sich ein Torwart um, ja, wenn er sich vom Zug schmeißt? So? Hm? Oh my God, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another amazing video. Today we're going to be checking out, obviously, German Cabaret oder Deutsch brutal satire comedy whatever you want to call it <laughs> satire with some truth in it a uh, truth with some satire in it comedy with some truth slash satire german cabaret like comment subscribe turn your post notifications i would also like to mention the subtitles in this video may or may not be legit as far as being totally accurate but if it conveys the message that's all we really need to see this is one of the stand-up shows from sidar sumunchu let's not waste any time let's go stellt man sich Bayern vor, hässliche Menschen vor leeren Tellern und vollen Gläsern, wenig Ausländer. Oh my God, he started off 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 rip violent, bro. His guy started off on on, on demon time. <laughs> uh, somebody said I sense some n bombs being dropped in this video. Und der Laden ist sicher. <laughs> Noch. Wir wissen nicht, was passiert. Oh my God. Es wird viel passieren. Es wird flächendeckend beleidigt. Ja? Dang. Totale I... Intoleranz. Ja? Total weckt bei manchen Leuten in Bayern falsche Assoziationen hervor. <lacht> Jede Minderheit hat ein Recht auf Diskriminierung. Hey, bro, at least he's like, hey, I might, I might discriminate, but I discriminate evenly, dog. I, everybody's gonna get a slice of this pie. Everybody's gonna get these hands, man. He's out the gate already more, like, I guess, direct. I guess, I can't even say direct. He's just more in your face, I feel like, than Volker Pisper would. I know a lot of people watching this might be like, stop comparing him to Volker Pisper. They're two totally different people. I am comparing them because those are the two most brutal comedians I've ever seen. <laughs> Honestly, somebody asked me in one of the previous videos I reacted to, do we have somebody like that in America? I honestly don't think we do today. We probably did 10 years ago, I think. I don't even think, Dave Chappelle was pretty hardcore, I'm not gonna lie. Dave Chappelle was hardcore, but I do feel like even the way they delivered it was a lot different. So maybe maybe they were like a step in, in, in intensity slightly under Sidar some, 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 some Nunchu and Volker Pisper, man. Just a step below. I don't know. If you guys can find a comedian from America that went pretty hard in the paint, please let me know because I would like to see it. Schwule nigger, Türken, schwule Juden, Neger und türkische Schwuljuden mit Vorliebe treffen. Oh, damn, he is, he is going crazy, bro. This guy is definitely, uh, oh, he's on demon time. He already dropped like five N-words, bro. Good, googly moogly, bro. All right, what does he what do, what do have to say? I gotta see if this is even funny, bro. What, 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 what? Der Deutsche hat eine historische Verantwortung zum Humor. Das heißt, wer nicht lacht, ist Nazi. <lacht> Nun, äh, damit oh. sind wir beim aktuellen Thema des Tages. Ich weiß nicht, ob äh, jemand es mitbekommen hat. Es war schwer zu übersehen und zu überhören. Robert Lemke <lacht> ist tot. Und zwar seit 20 Jahren. <lacht> Hier in München bei einer Herzoperation. Oh my God, that's a wild way to go out. Robert Enka. Oh my God, bro. I wonder if he was like, I mean, I know he was a, a football player, but this man jumped in front of a train. Jesus, that's dark. It says 96, by the way. Did he do this in 1996? Or did he do this as a 96 year old man? Hanover 96 is a soccer team. Oh, sheesh. Oh, he got internally crushed by the pressure of being a pro uh, celebrity. He was an active goalkeeper. Oh, like the 76ers. Okay, 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 okay. Hanover 96, he, that's the name of the team he was on. That makes sense. Man, bro, that's wild. It's a, this is, it's a hot take, man. It's a hot take. This is crazy. Tragisch gestorben. Der andere, den Sie meinten, der hat sich den Freitod ja selbst ausgesucht und sich zum äh, Mörder, äh, seine Frau zur Witwe, seine Tochter zum Waisen gemacht 
Und wir haben unseren Betroffenheitsduktus zelebriert und entdeckt, obwohl ich der Meinung bin, dass auch Tote verdienen, dass man Witze über sie macht. Oof, um, these jokes would not fly today, man. I, they wouldn't fly today. I, I, I said this before. There's just certain things. I know these days people are very adamant about not being joked about. This is, this is nuts. Ich habe mich beispielsweise gefragt, wie bringt sich ein Torwart um, ja, wenn er sich vor den Zug schmeißt? So? Ne? Oh my God, bro. Oh my Lord, dude. This guy is tweaking, bro. Ist es eigentlich schlimmer, dass ich die Witze mache oder dass sie drüber lachen? Nun ja, das ist nur der Anfang. Is it worse, worse that I make these bad jokes or that you laugh about it? Oh, dang, man. Oh, bro, he's stirring this pot crazy right now. Like, maybe, maybe Dave Chappelle was as, as, as intense as this. Because Dave Chappelle said some wild ass stuff. I'm not going to lie. But I get it. I, I do. I understand this kind of humor. I'm just saying, like I said earlier in this video, man, I'm telling you. And you guys can let me know if you, if you disagree with me. Do you think that his jokes today... A, would they fly in Germany? And B, would they fly worldwide? I feel like worldwide, they probably wouldn't. But in Germany, I feel like they kind of would. I don't know. Oh, he's still famous? I So he, it obviously flies in Germany. Would it fly in America? I could speak on that myself. Nah. Noch einige Passagen geben, die der ein oder anderen, ich sehe, es sind Ältere unter uns, die sich wahrscheinlich vertan haben. Die dachten, gehen wir mal zum Kanacken. Oh my God, bro. Also dieser Kaya Jana. <laughs> Nein, ich bin nicht Kaya Jana, auch nicht Kaya Jana mit kreisrundem Haarausfall. Ja. Ich werde sowieso nicht das tun, was Sie erwarten. Das ist Prinzip bei mir. Ich finde es schön, so wie auch beim Sex, den anderen zu überraschen. Oh mein Gott, Bro. Das ist und bei Comedy nicht mehr üblich. Selbst wenn ich Begriffe sage wie Fick, Fotzen, Dreckige, Huren, Schlampen, Kimmensau, ja, <lacht> bei denen sich die Fingernägel jeden, jedes Redakteurs kräuseln, weil er Angst hat, nein, der hat Kimme gesagt. Aber privat geht er in Kinderpuff und bumst Schweine. Bro, that's fucking wild, dude. I can't even, like, for, for monetary reasons, I can't repeat, like, 99% of what he just said, dude. YouTube be like, Hey, yo, what the fuck? Hey, it'll hit, it'll hit the American algorithm just fine. I just can't say anything he's saying. I can't say what he's saying. I can't. Because, like I said, in Germany, yes, this would be yellow. But in America, since it's under a different algo, it's, it might be green. This has happened before. Die bekommt man nicht durch Analverkehr. Yeah, he did. Mit Schweinen, ja? Sondern mit Leuten, die schweinisch sind höchstens. Die sich in die Hand trotzen. Und dann sagen, hallo. Ja? Oh, bro, what the fuck? Wir werden sogar regiert von einer Regierung des Mittelmaßes. Ja, wir werden vertreten im Ausland von einem Außenminister, der vorher wohl möglich noch Sexualpraktiken hatte, ja, die seine Autorität eher schmälern in Afghanistan. Oh my God, bro. Einfach gesagt, kann man sich durchsetzen, wenn man vorher hingehalten hat? Ja? <lacht> Oh, sheesh, bro. I think some points that he hits on might might be a little... A lot of his points that he hits on are too much, but I'm saying, like, some of the, 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 the punchlines in his jokes are a little, like, you know, they can be kind of repetitive. It is definitely jarring, bro. I don't know if you've seen it in the last few days. The fears that your thoughts, your thoughts, your thoughts, are actually very often in the day. Die Schweinegrippe, allen voran, Grassi. So Schweinegrippe, is like, is that like a pig grip? The, die, die Schweinegrippe? That's what he, what he just mentioned. That's like a pig grip or something, right? Oh, swine flu. Holy mother of God, bro. Oh, wait a minute. This is gotta be a stand-up from like, uh, well, swine flu was a thing in basically like, what, 2015? Or was that 20, 2011? This is old, bro. 2009. God dang, I didn't know that. Longer ago? Good God. Und irgendjemand sagt uns, Vorsicht, ne? du könntest dich anstecken. Ja. Und dann wackeln wir zur Impfung, obwohl die Impfung vielleicht viel gefährlicher ist. Oh, this, gefährlich. bro, this, this is the perfect stand-up for after the, after the pandemic, man. Bro, if people see this, 
if this goes on my channel and there's no yellow bro and you're watching this video man this video could not be more relevant after the pandemic bro switch it around like instead of all the other illnesses he like listed just replace that with what we just had and then boom uh, Vietnamese, mag ich auch nicht. Ja? Oh my God, bro. Die setzen Armadas von China-Taxis und geben sich als Chinesen aus. Der Ausländer in seinem ausländisch sein hat ja auch ein Kastensystem erfunden, um sich dem Deutschen anzudienen. Da ruft man dann an, weil man chinesisch essen will. Und es hebt jemand ab und sagt, jeder Tag, guten Tag. Da merke ich doch sofort, da ist was faul. Das klingt doch nicht nach kantonesischem Akzent. Oh my God, bro. Wenn wir eine Frühlingrolle haben, ja, wir haben einen Job durch mit dem Fleisch, wir haben auch mit Schweinefleisch, wir haben... God damn, bro. How do... I, I want to see him imitate an American speaking Deutsch, man. This, this is... This is... I, I don't even think edgy is the word for this, man. Like, this is this is nutty, bro. This is nutty. He wasn't saying this was his beliefs as far as how he would treat people. He said this is how a lot of German people would treat, like, other cultures and stuff. So he's speaking on that kind of behalf, that front, what, from what he's observed. So it's almost like he's taking a mirror, like Holy Squirrel said, and shoving it in people's face and saying, look at yourself. Boom, that's 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 the society you live in. And it sounds bitter and hardcore when you're hearing it from somebody and you're like, you shouldn't say that, stop, da, 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 da. But you miss the point sometimes when you kind of like look at the stand-up as that, you know? But the way he did, he the, like I said, the way that he conveys his point makes him look like a, you know, makes him look like a, you finish that, that sentence. So primitiv, dass die einschlägigen Fernsehsender, die die Asozialen promoten, mittlerweile ihren eigenen Protagonisten nicht mehr vertrauen und sie untertiteln. Oh Obwohl sie Deutsch sprechen. Oh my God. Die Mama hat dir schon tausendmal gesagt, du sollst die Scheiße lassen. Oh my God. Bro. Bei Ossis würde ich es ja noch verstehen. Oh my God, bro. Hey, kind of like talking a little bit generally about what he was just talking about as far as like people from another country, like, you know, speaking and them having like uh, subtitles translated underneath them and stuff like that. And, you know, th them saying what they actually mean versus like what people think they're saying. This kind of goes into that, but not really. Ich hasse Ossis. <laughs> Bro, oh my God. Somebody told me like the difference, like Aussies and Vessies, I think, right? I'm not sure if Vessies is a thing. It's a, th it's a thing still. I heard some stuff. That's all I'll say. I, I just heard more stuff about Aussies, man. I'll put it this way. I was told when I first got into like, you know, diving into German related stuff, people were saying, if there is a place you should avoid, when you get to Germany, it is the eastern side of Germany. Now, and like I said, not sure how accurate that is. I've never been to Germany, blah, blah, blah. But they basically said it's just more conservative. And a lot of people over there are like, it's like, it's almost like the su southern part of the United States, but on the eastern side of Europe, if that makes sense. <laughs> Jetzt versperren sie uns die Skipisten und werden noch zum Mörder. Ja? Und dann fallen sie ins Koma und wenn sie aufwachen, sagen sie, ich erinnere mich an gar nichts mehr. Damn. Wait a minute. So there was a politician in East Germany that committed an atrocity and then fell into a coma and woke up and said he didn't remember anything of it. Can someone give me details of that? Who is you he referring to here? Is he referring to to the Schumerman guy, the Sch the Schumacher guy, or what? Because I have no idea like what what politician he was talking about. Michael Schumacher did an accident and fell into a coma. Was it like a driving accident where he accidentally ran somebody over? Oh, Dieter Althaus killed a woman in an accident with skis. A skiing accident. Oh my gosh. The woman died. The politician fell into a coma. Oh my god, bro. Oh my God, Schumacher was way later, no? So did Schumacher fall into the same thing? Was it another skiing accident? He had a skiing accident and flew into a coma, but no other person was harmed. Oh, okay, 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 okay. But daran, that you Ministerpräsident warst, erinnerst du dich noch, du Knallpfeifer! <laughs> so ein Kleinkrimineller zahlt heutzutage 60.000 Euro und ist rehabilitiert. Ja? Bei anderen dauert 60 Jahre, bis sie rehabilitiert sind. 
Nun, falls Sie also gekommen sind, weil Jesus Sie dachten, Christ. Kayana oder politisch korrekte Kabarett scheiße. Ja? Ich beherrsche nicht mehr die Terminologie des politisch korrekten. Ich sag, well, ah, obviously, ah, bro, we, we saw that. He said, I don't know how to use politically correct terminology. Bro, he hasn't said one politically correct thing since this video started. He opened up the video on Demon Time. Oh my Lord, bro. Der Hassprediger feiert Opferfest im Schlachthof. <lacht> da kommen die Leute. Ja? Wenn ich jetzt schreiben würde, Serdar Somunju liest Franz Kafka, da wäre die erste Reihe hier nicht da. Die Bro, kennt what the YouTube, fuck? Ja? Und scheitert schon an der Semiotik der ersten zehn Minuten. Ich Deswegen ist der Titel auch gelogen. Hassprediger gibt es nicht. Gab es auch vorher nicht. Früher habe ich immer Hitler auf die Plakate geschrieben. Oh shit, bro. Hitler! Und alle, yeah, yeah. This man, bro, he doesn't give a fuck. Es hat sich gelohnt. Mittlerweile wird Hitler mit mir verwechselt. <lacht> Leute sagen, ach komm, das ist doch eh wieder der Kabarettist, dieser Türken-Kabarettist. Wenn Hitler das wüsste. Ne? Adolf, ja! Weißt du, heute im Schlachthof Hitler spielt? Nein! Der Türke! Ah! Bro, he literally got people who had that I like thought and believed to attend his shows. God dang, bro. This this was a lot. This was a lot. This was also probably the worst translation I've ever had in a video ever. This video was definitely insane. Insane. This guy is definitely what way more intense as far as, you know, cracking jokes that might be on the offensive side than Folker Pisper for show. This video is definitely gonna be heavily edited. Okay. Well, you guys let me know what you think in the comments down below. Um, looking at the the cabaret scene in Germany in general, the satire, the comedy, the, the cabaret. Definitely more intense than America, man. But at the time that he released this stand-up, I'm pretty sure there were stand-up comedians that were kind of similar to him here. What a show, bro. What a show. You guys already know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your post notifications. This guy was he 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 was funny. He just said some wild ass shiznit, bro. But he was funny as hell. I'll see you guys later. Take care. Peace.